welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all having an amazing day. So today I'm doing a video. Well, I've already filmed it. I'll show you exactly how I do my hair like this and my exact hair routine. All the products I use, all the products I swear by. I'm so excited for you guys to see this video. So let's get onto it. So I'm just about to jump in the shower in the video now. So let's go. Alright, so I'm just jumping in the shower now. I use products by Pure Hair Care. I use their Forever Blonde shampoo. I do two shampoos. That's actually my biggest tip. Do two shampoos. I thought that was just something that everyone knew. But two shampoos are super important. So the first shampoo just lifts the dirt and then the second shampoo actually gets rid of the dirt. So now I'm just putting in a one minute treatment by Juice and then I'm using my Forever Blonde conditioner to condition my hair. These products are all animal cruelty free and Australian made, which is obviously amazing. in the salon for a little bit so I quickly did that and then while I was down there I was just like why don't I dry my hair you know to save some time but anyway I'm finally here I'm finally ready to curl my hair by the way look how nice my color is so I literally got my color done three days ago so the products I used were not as strong I just want to show you so I have my little bag of juice products because juice um gave me some products for me to show you guys i already use all these products anyway so it's just a little bit of a top up so if my hair is like getting really yellowy or getting really brassy i like to use some stronger purple shampoo it'll lift the color and turn it a bit more of a nicer blonde tone but i don't like my hair to be too silver so I don't use that every day, all the time. If I don't want my hair to be too silvery, I use these products because they are not as strong as, say, the intense ones. So these ones are for maybe, for me, I use it every now and then because it's too strong for my hair. So I personally don't use these every day. Just when my hair's looking really yellow, not very nice, I use these ones when I need a toner and it's getting close to that time where I need to foil my hair again I like to use this semi-permanent foam conditioning color toner this one is really good like I said I don't use this one all the time because it's a toner with toners like this you can do it yourself you don't have to go to a hairdresser to get a toner so you can just use this one I just apply it to my hair in the shower i do a shampoo and then i just towel dry my hair i would probably leave it on for about two to five minutes it says two to ten minutes here so yeah i leave it on for about two to five minutes just while i'm in the shower just don't get it wet just shave your legs or something while you are doing that so yeah these two are my go-to's these are amazing i always use these ones every single shampoo it's for blonde hair so all these products i'd say are for blonde hair but that in their range they have stuff for all different hair types these two products are my god damn faves this one is called smooth ends i've used this for about a year i do not use anything else this one i use it in the purple color or the i can't remember what it's called 
but it's like a blue one um and these are just like leave-in treatments so you just put it in and it's just like a leave-in treatment and you do everything as normal but it makes your hair feel so nice and so soft so before i curl my hair i use this heat shield it's just heat protection to be honest i haven't always used heat protection i until i was given this product i know i always should use heat protection but i just just never have so yeah when juice gave me this product i was like oh my god i need to try it out because everyone uses heat protection but me you can do this with towel dried hair or completely dry hair um like mine i just do like completely dry hair it really doesn't matter though all right so i just like lightly spray from pretty far away like so with curling my hair I love curling short hair now. It's literally so much fun. It just depends with short hair. So sometimes I'll get my hair like so banging good. And then other days I'm like, oh my God, this looks so bad. I use a clip and I clip it up. I don't usually like do the bottom, do my first section like really big because I don't really like to do the bottom butts. I just straighten the ends because I like my ends to be a bit straighter. Don't straighten the whole piece of hair. I don't like my hair to be perfect. I like it to be sort of like rough and a bit, a bit like not so tidy and clean. So what I do to make it look a little bit more rough, I curl it like all different ways. I usually curl the first couple backwards because I don't want my hair to be in my face and then the rest I'll curl like one back one forward just to make a little bit more rough it doesn't have to be perfect that's what I do with my hair I don't like it to be perfect I use a cloud nine and I turn the heat up to 200 with the cloud nine I definitely recommend using an iron no the ones are way easier to use but I find that it takes so much longer to use a wand just taking the time to learn how to use a flat iron and to be honest I think it looks better personally this down because I don't want it to be too curly and then you see how there's that little bit on the end I don't go all the way and I don't call that so I I'd say that's a little bit curly for me but it doesn't matter I just go back and um Fix it at the end if I don't like it and then pull down like that and then I usually go and straighten these ends bits at the end of this and I go what? like that and then this one I'll curl the other way like that and that's just to give it some texture and some body and you see these bottom bits I usually just do a little twist as a big section just a little twist because you know you can't just have it completely straight and then i go into the next section and i just do the same thing all the way around so i'll just straighten the end it usually does not take me too long to do my hair i can usually just pump it out i'm pretty quick at it now Especially doing short hair. So quick and easy. Alrighty guys, this is 
the end product. This is like a few hours later and it still looks great. But anyway, so the products I love um, are by Pure and Juice. I'll put their links in the description below if you guys want to check out any of their range. I have always used these products and find that it makes my hair feel so much better but also look so much better. So if you guys want to check them out, the link is in the description box below. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment, and I will see you in another video. Bye guys, stay rosy.